The crippling three-month-long wage strike in the platinum sector looks set to continue after talks between mining companies and Union Amku were again abandoned last week. Workers are holding out for a 12,500 rands monthly salary to be implemented over four years. Over the weekend, Anglo-American held meetings with employees and Impala Platinum sent SMSs to its workers informing them of the new wage offer. But most of the striking miners say they are not interested in engaging directly with their employers. I'm not even going to associate myself with these meetings that our employers are having. Mku said it will meet with us workers on Tuesday morning. I don't see this as a solution because we have mandated our leader, Mr. Matunja. The employer never gave us the money we wanted in the first place, so the employer must negotiate with our union. I heard about the meeting, but I didn't go because I have a union who speaks to the employer on my behalf. A labor analyst warns that the current situation could lead to a conflict between the workers. For them to say they will go and talk to the employers, to say they will go and talk to and talk to employees directly, it must be discouraged because if you recall, uh, January 2012, we found ourselves in the same situation where employers broke the protocol uh, in the platinum strike then with just one employer and they went and spoke to the employees and what followed was a, a massive violent strike. Anglo-American plans on talking to workers in the Eastern Cape on Tuesday. Sibongile Mkani Marikana in the Northwest. Know more about your world. ENCA.com